Okay. You have to see us backstage because we literally have no idea I what we're putting on until we come out here and we go. <laughs> like, huh. What? I think I went to the wrong dressing room. I don't even know. It kind of matches. I don't yeah. know who's this is. I mean, By the way, and uh, okay, well, really anyway, maybe that makes yeah. it better. I can when in doubt, pull up your. <laughs> yeah, see? Now we're cool. Hey. Yeah. Hey, you know what it is? Yeah, it's Jen. You are. <laughs> this week we're focused on workouts you can do right there at home. Today's workout is from the author of Bigger, Leaner, Stronger. And he says that no matter what age you are, you should be strength training. Please welcome Michael strength Matthews. Training. He is. Strength training. Getting so strength training is good for um, bone density, right? Yep. Isn't that what they say? Absolutely. Yeah. So I want what you have. <laughs> How do we get there? What, how do we do Strength it? training, of course. So yeah, these, okay. are, these are all bones, are they? Yeah, Just kidding. Yeah. With something else, I don't know, bones. Yeah. And, Why do you say but, any age? Um, well, you know, because strength training improves your body composition, right? So that matters whether you're 20, 30, 40, 50. Mm -hmm. And that means that it adds muscle to the right places in your body. It helps you remove fat from the it's right places. It's not 50 like it's death after 50. Right. Yeah. You know, ironically, it's just, it's just it's slow decline. Not even. I saw right. on Facebook a couple days ago a 72-year-old powerlifter who makes me look out of shape, basically. Really? So, yeah, Goals, no, right? you, can, you, can, you can do it really huh. any, Well, let's do it. Run us through okay, this. Okay, so let's do, let's do a whole body strength training workout. Yeah. You can do this at home. All you need is a bench and some dumbbells. If you don't okay. have a bench, you can even actually start with a chair and maybe some water jugs okay but let's go with the warm-up first right so that's an important part of strength training yeah and let's warm up our lower body so let's do some body squats stand tall stand tall yep feet about hip width apart okay. why is it that women and I've been told this when you tell women to stand hip width apart we always do this why do we think that our think, hips are out here? You think your hips are bigger than they are? Maybe? Is that, I mean, it really is true. Okay, you want so, a good so hip That's width why. apart. Okay. okay. Okay, so then start the movement by hinging at the hips, pushing the butt back, and then bending at the knees and going deep, low, low, low. Make it hard. Okay, good. Now up, and then squeeze your glutes squeeze to the top. It. Yeah, That's right. Nice. Squeeze it you like know. a nutcracker. That's right. That's right. We can do one more. Yeah. Now, I'd recommend... Two sets for the warm-up, but for time, we'll just do a couple okay. reps. Okay, okay good. So, so now let's say our lower body's good to go. We're going to have to yeah. do the same for upper bodies. Let's do push-ups. Yeah. Down in the push-up position. Mm. All right. So keep your elbows kind of tucked in, mm -hmm. and then all the way down. And if you can't do this, you can do it on your knees. One. And another one. Come on, Ryan. Two. Ryan. Oh, there we go. All right. <laughs> We're warm. Let's do it. Okay. okay. All right, we're warmed up. Exercise. Let's, let's get to the workout. Let's start with the goblet squat. So Goblet, goblet squat? Squats? Yeah. It's okay. a squat, and you'll see. Okay. okay. So let's uh, grab one of our dumbbells with our right arm here. Okay. Grab our dumbbell. Okay. I have the 20s, you have the 10s. Okay. That's, uh, that's how it worked out. I'm not as strong as I look. I'm actually pretty weak. Uh, right. so, so, you want, so you want to hold the dumbbell like a goblet, right? Like yeah. this in front of you. Oh, okay. And then we're kind of actually just replicating what we do with the body squat. Okay. okay. So we're hinging at the hips. All the way down, making it nice and hard. Up. And breathe there out, you go. right? And, yep, and breathe out on the way up. Yep. <sighs> and squeezing your glutes. Good, good, good. So this is all glute. Looking good. Okay. Perfect Benefits form. Yeah. Glute. All right. Perfect and, form. And that's important. That? Yeah. Form, hear that, right, right? I'm not shocked. You always have like a nutcracker. <laughs> And form is worth mentioning because in strength training, doing the exercises correctly is super important right. because it makes them more effective and it prevents injury. Right. What's next? Right. What's your, so the dumbbell deadlift is next. So for that, you can grab your other dumbbell here. So we okay. need both of them. Okay. And we're gonna keep them. We're gonna keep them at our side. <laughs> Stand tall. And so this exercise, it's similar with the squat. You start by hinging at the hips, mm -hmm. and then you're pushing your butt away from you, keeping your back in kind of a flat tabletop position as they move down. Mm -hmm. and you kind of want to move down your legs until your hamstrings say, like, yeah, no more. Okay. And then you go up and you squeeze. It's good, Okay, actually. good. So yeah. let's, let's, yeah. let's do another one. And, and Kelly, if you, just keep, perfect, if you just keep the weights moving down your legs and keep your legs <laughs> yeah. a little bit straighter, Stra like oh, a little straighter. bit closer. Yeah. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. And you should, there you go. Yeah, and up. oh, yeah. And this is a great oh, whole yeah. body exercise. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Good. The difference, right. Good, good, good. And I'd recommend yeah. two sets of about sets. six right. to ten reps. Okay. Right. Let's do another two, one. Two minutes we of do one set of about yeah. two. What's that? Okay, good. So let's do upper body now. Yeah. Okay. For the upper body, we're going to do the dumbbell bench press. So for that, we need both of our dumbbells, which you already okay. have, which is great. Let's get to the edge of our bench. <laughs> Kelly's ready to go. She knows what we're doing. She does two hours of this thing a day. <laughs> okay, good. So we're going to get back okay. in a position here, our feet flat on the ground, shoulder blades pinched, elbows kind of at the next to us. And then we just press up with our palms facing our feet. And there we go. Squeeze at the top. Squeeze at the top. Breathe and squeeze. Okay. Perfect. Again. 
I would recommend two sets, six to ten repetitions with about two minutes of rest in between. Kelly, you're ripped. So you're nice right. work over there. How much do you bench, Kelly? She's I mean, so I don't know. More than this. I feel like this is not a lot of weight. Here, you yeah. want mine? Well, for, <laughs> for everybody. There goes my mic. <laughs> so the benefits of that chest. So yeah, so it helps sculpt the chest, okay. the shoulders, oh, yeah. the back of the arm. Well, right, obviously it's flabby. working for me. Yeah. Clearly. <laughs> <laughs> arms? Yep. Arms? All right, last we'll, we'll one. Do, Ryan, what we'll do is we'll do a pull. We'll do, we'll do a, a pull, pull. Which, also, okay. which also does arms. Okay. So last exercise here is the dumbbell row. Again, this is a pulling exercise. So what we want is just one dumbbell for this one. Okay. Let's do our right arm first. Okay. So let's grab with the right. Let me tuck this back in. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Let's get to the back of our bench, actually. Okay. I like that, though. <laughs> kind of like a kettlebell swing. All right, so okay. we're going to yeah. put our left leg on the bench. We're gonna get in this kind of tabletop position again. Have our right arm fully extended, and Ooh. as we're bringing up, the idea is to squeeze your shoulder blades together. So you should mm. really feel it in that kind of big muscle on the side of the, your body, the lat, yeah. right? By the way, so this makes your shoulders bigger and your waist look smaller, even if your waist doesn't get smaller. Uh, instantaneous. Right, <laughs> it's an optical illusion. <laughs> no, this is more based on strength training. You can go to livekellywyatt.com, our website. Good. Good to see you, man, thank you so much. We'll be right back. For more January info, just go to our website.